Student Veterans of America is a nationwide organization focused on helping veterans who are uh, pursuing higher education just better themselves educationally, also create a support network for them across the nation. The Leadership Institute is a 72-hour crash course that gives student veterans the tools and resources as well as providing a professional uh, atmosphere for them to practice those tools and resources towards implementing them back into their professional and personal lives. It is learning who you are, going through what makes you who you are, and figuring out how you can progress and what is holding you back in your career. When I joined um, the Student Veterans of America, I wasn't sure what it was supposed to feel like or what it meant to be part of the SVA. Um, working together with my other peers in our work study, we plan a lot, we, we network a lot, we socialize, we talk about our experiences a lot. But after going to the Leadership Institute, I feel like I am a part of something big. I am a, just like when I was in the military, when I was in the Navy, I had that camaraderie, I had that support. I personally wanted to go to the SVA Leadership Institute because since I've gotten involved in the SVA, I've refound my purpose and uh, I've gotten in touch with a family other than my own family at home. Leadership Institute helped me remember what it was like to be a part of uh, an organization that really means something. I want an opportunity where I felt equal to people and also find a sense of direction for myself. Prior to the SVA Leadership Institute, I prepared in the way that I wrote down things that I wanted to work on. If I could take back at least one thing, I wanted to make sure that I took back something that I can bring back into my personal life, my professional life, and my family life. And I think I accomplished those goals on each level. Got a hold of a couple of the different alumni, kind of asked what, what to expect, you know, for a schedule, uh, you know, how intense was it going to be, what I should be bringing, uh, what mindset I should be going down there with. I wanted to make sure that our team was good and that we had everything we needed and we double checked and buddy checked. Being able to actually open up and feel like you are heard and listened to, there wasn't a single thing that I felt like I was struggling with that somebody else wasn't as well. Something that I learned was I'm not alone. A lot of other people felt the exact same. Everyone was able to skip the awkward introductory stages and everyone was able to be so safe and compatible and work right into building each other up. The biggest thing I took away was how much I bottled up on the inside and just being able to talk about that with not only like the people you meet, the mentors you're with, but your team as a whole. I've gotten so much closer with my team. It was probably one of the single most uplifting events that I've had since uh, separating from the Air Force. This is beneficial. Whether it benefits one person one way or another, there is something that you'll be able to take out of this institute. I want to be a part of being there for the students here and have be an outlet for people to come to and actually talk about how they feel and their goals. One thing I realized is that I was really limiting myself to only being one type of leader. I have a particular brand of it called servant leadership that I had been exuding without really knowing it. My mentor, Will, actually outlined it and went over it and saw how he took that in the Marine Corps as well and bridged the gap into the civilian world and we really figured out where I'm going, where I am, and how to get there. I discovered about my leadership style, more of what my brand is and what that means. I learned how to adapt it better to the audience that I'm approaching. The next thing for me to come back from the Leadership Institute is to focus on disseminating the information I got from the Leadership Institute while working towards NatCon and working with other leadership fellows in the local area to build our chapters up together. I'm gonna to continue to be a hard charger as a part of the SBA and part of everything that we have here. So by working on myself and by kind of getting my mental back in check, um, I think that I'll be able to help others and continue leading and grow more as a leader. Every day I need to hold myself accountable. Am I really working on where I want to be in 30 years? What's next for me after attending the Institute is NatCon. It's an event that I definitely will attend. And along with keeping in touch with every connection I've made. I'm happy that I stepped out of my comfort zone and made it my own experience um, and really connected with everyone. I am a Bristol veteran. 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 I'm a Bristol veteran. We, we are. are. Yeah.